Welcome to this session. This session, we are going to discuss about pole of order M and some different types of singularities. So pole of order M, let a function have an isolated point So let a function f of z have an isolated singular point z equals to a, then f of z can be expanded in Lorentz series. around this point z equals to a. Giving. f of z is equal to a naught plus a1 into z minus a plus a2 into z minus a squared plus a3 z minus a power 3 plus other several terms of the same pattern plus B1 over Z minus A plus B2 over Z minus A squared plus B3 over Z minus A power three plus BM over Z minus A power M plus bm plus one over z minus a raised per m plus one plus b Bm plus two over z minus a raised power m plus two plus other several terms. So let's call this equation one. So in some cases, In some cases, it may happen that the coefficients BM plus one is equals to bm plus two is equals to bm plus three plus the rest of the terms are equals to zero then one reduces to f of z is given by a0 plus a1 
into z minus a plus a to z minus a squared plus a3 z minus a power 3 plus several terms plus b1 over z minus a plus b2 over z minus a squared plus b3 over z minus a power 3 and then the last term will be Vm over z minus a power m, i.e. z can be written as, f of z can be written as a naught plus a1 into z minus a, plus a2 into z minus a squared plus a3 into z minus a cubed plus one over z minus a power m into b1 into z minus a or m minus one plus b2 into z minus a power m minus two plus b3 into z minus a or m minus three up to plus bm. So that's how we can write the Lorentz series of the function f of z around the point z equals to a. So then in this case, z equals to a is called or is said to be a pole of order m. of the function f of z at a point z equals to a. And then when m is one, the pole is said, to be a simple pole. And then in this case, the function will be of the form So f of z will be given by a naught plus a1 z minus a plus a2 z minus a squared plus a3 z minus a power 3 and then plus other terms and then plus b1 over z minus a. So that's how we define a simple pole or a pole of order one. So if the number of negative terms, negative powers is 
number of terms of negative powers in the expansion of equation one is infinite then z equals to a is called an essential singular point of f of z So in the next session, we discuss about movable singularity and state the rules on how to find singularities of a function f of z. Thank you.